Alright, uh, what's Bonnie got for us? Oh, hey. So, they want you to run some supplies out to the guys working at the expansion? Real simple, just take this over to them. That's not that hard. That jacket looks real nice. I don't know what Tavia's talking about. What's wrong? Well, Reggie's Clint? just died. Right? Reggie. Reggie's dead. What? What are you talking about? Carver killed him. He pushed him off the roof. Maybe... Maybe it was just an accident. That was no accident, Bonnie. She's in denial. Listen to me. Take this stuff out to those guys and come straight back. Alright. Just be safe, okay? <sighs> now ain't the time to be calling attention to yourself. God. I need to go find out what happened. God. Hey, God Troy! Clint's just gonna take them boys some nails. Alright. Go on. Oh, that is gross. Hey, that ain't your concern. Get that stuff over to them boys. Just follow them cables. Shut up, Tron. Tron, I mean Troy. Yeah, <laughs> Tron. Just follow them cables. That is not a very good fortification. Oh god. Let him do this shit themselves if it's so goddamn important. Get my your fucking hands off you me. You ain't man. gonna force me to do this bullshit. Can I said get your hands off me. Or what? You gonna go tail on me? I'm trying to help you, asshole. Yeah, this is a real help. Why don't you just worry about yourself? Reggie's dead. Carver killed him. What? You sure? Or did you Oh shit, you oh, walked fuck. Grab something! Oh god, okay. Time for me to do stuff. Okay. Oh god, come on. Okay. Crap. Go. Oh god. Yeah. Hold it. Oh god. Q Q Q Q Q. E. Oh, that was good. Good kill. Oh god. Um that oh that could Oh god. I saw a screwdriver. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, you're having a laugh. What? Oh, thank god. That is hard. Thank god for that. Get up. Get out of there. Come on. Make thank you, Troy. Ass. Jesus. Oh, thank God, you're okay. All right, enough mushy shit. You get back inside right fucking now. I'm sure they got shit for you to do in there. Now! Think I'm fucking around? Now I gotta sit down here and babysit you assholes. Can't do a simple fucking patch job without me here cracking the whip? Jesus Christ. That was intense. Very intense. Do, do, da, da. do I seriously have to walk down here? I'm fu- Oh god! Who's that? Who's this? Who's this? Who's this? Ah, ah, stop! Oh, hey! Luke! It's me! Luke! Hello! Yes! Bloody hey. hell! Get the hell out of me! Long time no Make see! Blood. Come all this way! This is- this is the welcome- Hi Luke! I missed you Luke! I was worried! We all were! Now it's good to see you too kid! Alright, listen, we ain't got much time! Okay, I 
Okay, I thought I just heard an alarm. Did y'all hear best I could? I haven't had a night's rest since y'all got nabbed. Well, that's the first chance I got to talk to somebody. <laughs> They're everywhere, okay? They got guards watching everything. Shh, shh. There's a herd of lurkers just south of us. It's bigger than I ever seen around these parts. Oh, God. Harper mentioned that. Said he hopes it passes us. Yeah. Yeah, I heard folks talking about that, but that ain't so. Okay, it's gonna hit this place. I know it is. Now, I don't know when, but it's coming, and it's gonna be soon. Okay. See, I've been looking for places to, to get you all free. I have to go. When is the head coming? I haven't been able to find anything yet. Are you feeling okay? It looks uh, like weird. No, I mean, uh, yeah. Yes. Sorry. I, I just could use some sleep, you know. Hard to rest when you think a lurker's about to get the jump on you at any any moment. But yeah, <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. Okay, don't worry about me. It seems dangerous. Well, the whole situation's dangerous, but well, we're in it now. It's what we got. We just we just need a plan. No way to get you and, and everyone. You all right, Luke? Bloody hell, Luke. Oh, sorry, sorry. Shit. Okay, Troy ain't gonna like you being late. Listen, Clem, I need you to meet me here tomorrow about this time. Because I, I need you to get me one of those radios, okay? Do you think you can do that? Just just one of those walkie-talkies. Okay. I just need to be able to tell y'all what's going on with them guards. You know, I'll figure out the schedule the patrols are on. I mean, they're, they're all over the place, but I can keep an eye on them for y'all from out here. Okay, thank you. Yeah, we're well. able to shoot our way out of here, so we gotta be careful. Okay, I'll get you one. Thanks, Clem. I'm so glad I can count on you. Remember, you meet me here tomorrow. I'll try and be here around this time, but if I ain't, just wait as long as you can, because I really need one of those radios. I should have asked just where you get them from right. now. Okay, I'm worried they, uh... Get out where I can see oh, crap. Go on, get out of here. Okay. The hell were you doing? Huh? Uh, hiding from walkers, nothing. Answer me. No, I'm not answering you. Silent treatment. Jesus Christ, you're as stupid as Sarah. <laughs> Bill Radio wants a word with you up in his office. So get on up there, now. You're as stupid as Sarah. <laughs> Wyatt! Hang on, I want to talk to Wyatt. Can we talk to Wyatt? Dude, you better go up and see Bill. He doesn't like to wait. Alright. So, you should probably go. <laughs> well, I'm glad to see he's alive anyway. But he's a part of this shit, shit fucking group. Oh, God. Oh, God, what's happened? She's a strong woman, surrounded by weak men. I ain't letting my kid get raised around that. Get in here. Oh shit, that's Alvin. He's dead. Alvin? Alvin! He passed out hours ago. He can't Okay, hear so nothing. he's not dead. No point in making a racket. Why are you doing this? Me and him, we got history. Understand? A couple things we had to get worked out. I wouldn't be so concerned about his well being if I were you. Not with you being so close to the fire yourself. Now. Screw you. I don't know whether I should be nice. You and make sure you tell me the truth when you're sitting where you are. And you won't end up over in that chair. Now you might not believe this after what Should I be nice or mean? I liked Reggie. He was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks like that. It's easy to let depression sink in during times like this. But he was weak. And I don't mean just because he was maimed. That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will. And weak of character. Mm -hmm. And we can't have that around here. Not anymore. Not with what we got at stake. Hey, you're a murderer. You can try and call it something else. But I know what it is. What it really is. Listen, Clementine, it ain't murder. You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw-ups lately. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. 
It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. You understand? Well, I wish it was different, yeah. I do. But they are weak, and we are strong. That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd the flock, to keep them safe. It's their nature to follow, not to lead. You know what I wish? What's that, honey? I wish Kenny had killed you. And there's all the proof I need right there. You think anyone out there would have the balls to say something like that? Actually, no. <laughs> oh, he did, but look where he landed. And we're more alike than you think. In fact, I think you realize it, but you're not comfortable with it yet. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized it back in that cabin. You were scared, but you looked me straight in the eye. Kept your nerve. That's what we need. If we're gonna get through this, the next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Kids like you, raised the right way. The way my child will be raised. He's Alvin, he's not your this son. herd that keeps me up at night. Uh, we can handle that. It's not your baby, it's Alvin's. Well, even if that was true, it's mine now. Alright, now. Well, you there? Yeah. Yeah? I'm here. Oh, we need that walkie talkie. Closing door is jacked. Try really knock the shit out of it. How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't think it's an emergency or anything, but it's something Stan should take a look at when he can. Stan. Get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Yeah. <laughs> Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. Asshole. What an asshole. Victor's Comics. Because we all know what we did this morning. I don't know what that son of a bitch is going to do next. So you want to ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show up? How is that better? Because this place will be fucking chaos when that thing hits. No one will be paying any attention to us. And that's when we go. It's our opening. We just gotta figure out a way to draw them to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill can do it. What is it with you? That's what it sounds like to me. You know that's not what he's sure, saying, Ehaw. but it does sound dangerous. This shit is all dangerous! Kenny, do not speak to me like that. Maybe Luke could help us. He's outside. He wants a radio to help keep an eye on the guards. Thank you. That's the plan I vote Wait. for. You know about Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Oh. Told us his plan. Mentioned he talked to you. If Luke can okay. tell us what's going on with the guards, we can use that to pick a good time to escape. That seems reasonable. Who knows when that'll be? There was a girl back at Crawford that used church bells to send walkers all over the yes. city. We just need something really loud. The PA system Carver is always using is quite loud. There's some speakers outside the building, pointed toward the parking lot. I saw them when we were walking. Ah, out to the yeah, yeah, yeah. Troy's always standing next to one of them. I saw the controls. They're in Carver's office. She's right. It's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that'll turn them on. How do you know that? I used to make a lot of the announcements back in the day. Mm. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't much around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. That's perfect. We just gotta get into his office. Why didn't you say something sooner? Because it doesn't change anything. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. And, and it's, it's still, still stupid. stupid. <laughs> the sensible thing is to get Luke the radio and wait for, and a wait for an opening. You're real difficult to deal with sometimes. Penny. No, that's all right. We can do both. You ain't exactly a peach either. Why can't we do both? Even if we bring the herd to us, it's probably good for Luke to be able to tell us where they're coming from. You know what? Fine. I can get behind that. Okay, so we get that turd radio. He keeps us turd. posted on the herd's movement. We fire up the PA thing and bring the walkers to roll over this place. And then what? Get some guns and shoot our way out. I don't know. Whatever we can. Oh, that's we'll a improvise. bad plan, though. So the that's not a plan. Yeah. You don't plan to improvise. I figured out what your problem is. You don't think this stuff through. If the end of the plan is just to stroll through a herd of walkers, then you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. Mother our shit in Actually, guts. 
I do it all the time. Oh shit, hello. You talking now? I didn't know you had I thought you were mute. First words I ever hear you say and it's just some crazy stupid shit. Hush. What do you mean exactly? Hush. When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. They can't tell oh, you. Oh yeah, they don't know. Them. I'm thinking they're new. No, I don't know who's crazy. No, it's true. Trust me. I've walked through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. Lee we did. figured that out. What? It's how we got out of the marsh house. Lee covered me and we walked right through. Yeah. Really? Holy shit. Oh, good one, Lee. All right. Oh, what are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. Miss Lee. We still have to find a way to get in the stock room. I got a plan for that, too. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. Okay, so she's quite cool. She's a badass. Where the hell did she come from? All right, what are we doing, Jane? We just need to use the winch. She can just climb up from there. Then just drop into one of the skylights over the stock room. There are shelves and stuff for you to land on, so you probably won't fall to your death. Great. That thing breaks all the time. Unless something's changed, it won't support much weight. Come on, up and at him. Don't push her, Kenny. She's our best bet. I mean that, Clem. Now or never, I guess. That's my girl. We gotta get that rope down. Mike, you wanna boost her up? Come on, kid. Come on, kid. Don't let go. I got you. Ugh. Oh, nice plan. Try to hurry, all right? What am I doing? I don't think they're the sharpest guards in the world, but they're no idiots either. What am I doing? They see you're not in your bunk. We're all done. Shit, he's coming back. I gotta let you go. I can't stand here. Grab something. Okay, grab, 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 grab. <gasps> Ow. Oh, God. Yeah, there are a lot We're of them. We are in trouble. We are in trouble, Clem. Well done. So next episode is when we will be going to find a radio or a walkie talkie for Luke. So thank you for watching, hopefully you enjoyed this part of the Walking Dead game. That is going to be the it, for it for this session, but you won't be able to tell when the sessions are. But um, yeah, I'm going to leave it a few weeks and then a few weeks, maybe a week or so and then play some more. But yeah, for now, thank you for watching, hopefully you enjoyed, if you did be sure to leave a like. Subscribe for more and I will see you guys next time. Bye!